This is Optimal Finance Daily, episode 195, the official list of allowed purchases this Black Friday by J Money of BudgetsAreSexy.com. And I am your host and narrator of Optimal Finance Daily, Dan. I'm here each Monday through Friday, holidays, Black Friday, any day of the year. Uh, We are here reading to you some of the best personal finance blogs on the planet. And today I've got a nice, fun, short post for you, although most of J Money's posts are fun, so nothing unusual there. But uh, he did have a perfectly relevant post for today, which is Black Friday here in the United States, the day after Thanksgiving when uh, stores do all their big discounts and encourage lots of consumer purchases. Now, before we start shopping, let's hear this post as we optimize your life. The official list of allowed purchases this Black Friday by J Money of BudgetsAreSexy.com. Every year around this time, I put on my clever hat and try to have some fun with Black Friday. This has produced a multitude of award-winning articles, such as How I Feel About Black Friday and Animated Gifts, Seven Things I'd Rather Do Than Shop on Black Friday, and my personal favorite, 10 Ways Black Friday is Like I swear, I deserve a raise. As I woke up this morning, however, I realized I'm in no mood to be funny. All I could think about were the poor souls about to swap feasts of turkey and family for fancy coupons and long lines hanging with rude people. And that's before Friday even hits. Bah, humbug. So I was relieved when I sat down at my desk to see a memo from the higher-ups demanding that I share it with you. Whew, off the hook. Here's what the note said. Dear Budgets Are Sexy Readers, This is Jay Money, CEO of Sexy University. By now, I'm sure you've read the 1,008 articles on the merits of Black Friday and are excited about all the money you'll be saving after all that spending. Hmm? This is a friendly reminder of corporate policy. You may not, in any circumstances, buy anything that does not involve financial education this weekend. This includes TVs, toys, CDs, is it Dave Ramsey? Clothes, candy, blow-up dolls, or any other miscellaneous tchotchkes. We are sick and tired of constantly being left out of these savings frenzies, and it's high time to send these faceless corporations a message. Finance lovers deserve coupons too. How will we get this message across? by purchasing as many personal finance-related items as possible, so demand rises and everyone's thus treated fairly in all future years. If money will be spent, it shall be for the greater good of our loved one's wallets. I have attached with this note a box of all approved objects that fit this strict code. If any reader is caught purchasing anything different this absence of color Friday, they will be punished to the fullest extent of financial law, and the real naughty ones will get letters sent to Santa telling him so too. Ooh. Respectfully yours, J Money, CEO and founder, Sexy University. Wow, talk about horrible bosses. The sequel is now out in theaters. Here were all the approved items from the box. The Millionaire Next Door, one of the best financial books ever written. Savings bonds. You can't get printed ones anymore. My boss is old, but you can buy them online. Budgets are sexy subscription. Get emails of all blog posts for free or even better, a one-on-one money coaching session with yours truly. I love Spreadsheets Mug to remind us of what's important in life. I Will Teach You to Be Rich, the second best finance book out there. Redskins Piggy Bank. There's a sticky here that says any bank is fine, except for the cowboys. Earphones. This one surprised me, but when I put them into my ear, I heard that soothing voice of Joe Saul Sehi from the Stacking Benjamins podcast and realized it was a reminder of all the kick podcasts there are out there available for download 24-7. Also gratis. Lastly, the box from the Grammy-nominated Cash in a Box single was in there as well. A reminder that you can always just <clears throat> put your cash in a box. And that was that. I'm actually quite impressed. My boss is usually quite boring around the holidays. He must have started on the eggnog early. I kind of agree with the sentiment, though. Why do we money lovers always get the shaft every year at these blowout sales? When was the last time finance books were 80% off, or debt balances cut in half, or better yet, deeply discounted stocks and houses? Oh, wait. Uh, gotta get back to work. See ya. You just listened to the post titled The Official List of Allowed Purchases This Black Friday by J Money of BudgetsAreSexy.com, a short and a silly post from our friend at Budgets Are Sexy, who, by the way, almost sold his websites recently after he got a $300,000 offer. He wrote about the story on his site. You can check that out at BudgetsAreSexy.com. Now, we're going to be giving away a book in just six more days to a random person on our email mailing list, 
So if you want to be entered into that drawing, you just need to be part of our weekly newsletter family. You can sign up for free at oldpodcast.com or a faster way to join is to simply text the word financial to the number 44222. And that's another week down. I'll be back with more posts for you next week. We are inching closer to that 200th episode that's coming up this next week. So have a great weekend and I'll catch you on Monday where your optimal life awaits. Hello, Life Optimizer. This is Justin Mollick, creator and producer of this podcast, but also Optimal Living Daily, the show where I read to you from even more blogs covering finance, productivity, minimalism, personal development, and more from incredible bloggers like Derek Sivers, Zen Habits, Mark and Angel, The Minimalists, and all the ones you hear on this show too. So if you enjoyed today's episode and like taking amazing blogs on the go, come on over to Optimal Living Daily and subscribe to that one too. And together, we'll start optimizing your life. You've been listening to Optimal Finance Daily. Be sure to hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on each new episode and head to oldpodcast.com. That's oldpodcast.com for a free gift as well as more actionable tips and resources to help you maximize your potential. Thanks for joining us. And remember, your optimal life awaits.